Hello everyone and welcome to the second episode of our Stalker Gamma Invictus run. Last episode we uh, had some fun. Pseudo Giant attacked the south checkpoint of Cordon. We got some good guns off of our well, off of our dead duty friends. Um, and today we are still looking for the basic tools. So what we will do is try and farm the southern areas for some missions, maybe get some stashes, hopefully, and uh, maybe some parts. Maybe we'll get to fix that shotgun. First of all, I'm going to check the task board, see if we have anything new here in Rostock. Okay, eliminate mutants in Crux Cemetery. Ah, uh, I probably won't go to Truck Cemetery until I get a better weapon. It's it's a little bit dangerous right now. And clear bandits in the wild territory. Ah, uh, sure, I'll take it. Also not a thing I plan to do. Not right now, at least. But who knows? Maybe those bandits will suffer through through a snork accident, or maybe they'll they'll tackle with our guys from duty. It's always great to have a free quest done for you. All right. So first thing, let's go south. Let's see if we can deal with that mutant in garbage. I. I'll actually stay at this campfire just a little bit so I can heal my health. Oh yeah, I can't ignite them in the rain. There should be another, another one close by. Hmm. I wonder, there might be an artifact here. This is always a little bit iffy. Not this way. No, okay. Where is it? Ah, plants. There we are. No? Is it on the other side? Looks like it. Hello? Artifact? Oh wow, Nightstar, wheat, fortunately this does emit radiation so I'll just do a quick run, drop it in the stash, have a little drink of water on the way, okay and now since my leg got hurt I'll just heal at the doctor. Hello there. Thank you, Mr. Aspirin. I actually don't have enough money to buy anything else, so... On we go. those who commented on my previous videos, thanks very much for the tip. I actually uh, did a little trial run with the auto looter and uh, yeah, it didn't work because I changed the key bind. But uh, now that I changed it back, it should work properly. Let's see. Oh, 
Some nice ammo. Now I might still loot them piece by piece sometimes, just out of habit. Oh shit! Okay, that was panic aim. <laughs> oh! I was ta it was just a tail. For a moment there I thought he, he actually dropped his... Uh... Where? Which would have been pretty good early on. If you notice any stuttering here, I'm really sorry. The game actually works perfectly. Unfortunately, uh, my uh, recording software doesn't really like this exact area of Rostock. <laughs> so it, it's always just a little bit uh, uh, iffy here. But otherwise, it seems to, it seems to work okay for the rest of the game. All right, here we are. Let's see what we got. Oh, there's already fighting happening. Oh, jar. <laughs> okay, looks like we're safe. I'll take that, thank you. Let's see anything else around here. I will actually take this. Since it can actually be fixed with a handgun kit. We actually have a chance to have a pretty good weapon at the start. In case we don't manage to to fix our five or five four five AK, and the shotgun part, great. I'll take this as well as actually. Okay, I think that's it. All right, let's see what do we have here. Uh Mutants in the garbage. Always kill mutants in the garbage. Even more killing mutants. Yes, please. As for the rest, I don't think I have anything they would want. Nope. Okay, let's see. Where do we have to go kill mutants? Hmm. Okay, we can try this. I'll try and go on top of that hill right there. Actually, I'll go left. And in the worst case, if I can't handle it, I'll try to lure them to the duty guys. No. Okay, it looks like it's just dogs. one. And that was two. Okay, can I actually get at you? Okay. What else we have? Oh, the other mutant killing was in, in um, Croc Cemetery. I didn't pay attention. Yeah, good enough. We'll get to it at some point. Hopefully the guy who gave us the mission won't die. Okay, 
So let's head to Butcher during an mission. And then south to Cordon. One of our friends died over there. Wonder who they're fighting. Oh, mercenaries. Not sure I should I should be actually Oh, cool. Got him. Okay, and there's another one here that's nearly dead. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming, I'm coming. I'll help you. Here. <laughs> I would love to see one of these guys drop a match, a USB. Mm. Oh wow. Oh wow. Okay, so we almost have a 5.56 five, weapon as well. <laughs> oh, did I not take it? Of course. Battle isn't that good, but uh, it's still worth keeping, I think. Okay, we'll swap to Hydroshock here since there's almost always mutants in front of the crane, crane yard. Go! Oh, crap! Up the hill! Up the hill! Oh, that was close. Never mess with boars. Whew. That was scary. A loner. Hmm. I'm not gonna waste bullets on this dog. I'll let the loner deal with it. Never mind. <laughs> In this case, we'll loot the loner. Wow. <laughs> okay, unfortunately I think this needs advanced tools right now, but I'll still take it. Just because it has a full barrel, so we might actually have an SVD fixed if we find the parts for it, before we even have basic tools. <laughs> You what I'll even put the parts back. You there. Finished the job and he gives us charcoal. I guess we were naughty for Christmas. Okay, and I'll sit here by the fire until I uh, regen a little bit of health. And we're back. Had a little rest, ate some rat skewers, had a cigarette, and now we're ready to take on Gordon. Do I actually have any money? Hmm. Do I have any bullets? Okay, 
I'll see if Butcher has some Hydro Shock. <clears throat> oh, what happened here? Okay. I have no idea what... Oh! Of course, zombies. I'm still amazed how NPC stalkers just die to zombies. Okay, let's see. I'll mark, mark these as favorite and... Hmm. Ah, sure. Um, I'll actually keep these for missions. Sell this, sell this. And that should be enough to get us a few bullets, which he doesn't have. Oh, well. On we go. Hmm. As always, keeping an eye out for boars in that direction. And I hear dogs. Well, it looks clear. can see two boars there. I don't really think I want to engage them right now. I'm pretty low on bullets. So let's just sneak by. And hope they didn't hear me. <clears throat> Yeah, we actually have to save someone here, so there will probably be bandits. Oh, there's another one there. Whew. 
<laughs> oh boy, that was close. mask as well. Hello buddy. Come with me. I'm pretty sure I have to take you up north, but um, you're coming with me. Oh, and we got the stash at the farm. Um, unfortunate anomaly placement there. There's usually some mutants around these parts, so let's keep an eye out. There he is. And when there, where there's one, there's always more. Did I get them both? One. Oh, that was a cat. There's still one alive. Sorry for the bad aim, I, I panicked. <laughs> Luckily, uh, I only got an arm hurt. And that's easily fixable with a bit of uh, ibuprofen and a bandage. Okay, I'm gonna stay away from... That place to the left. And head great to the farm. Grab a bite on the way. Sorry about that, that was my phone. <laughs> if you heard anything weird. Is that really all the loot here?
I guess that's it. Let's check this place as well. There's always food on the table, which is nice. And the stash. Which basically gives us nothing. <laughs> I mean, I shouldn't complain. We we did just get some of the luckiest drops at the start of the game and uh this episode with the SV with the SVU as well. Guessing I'm paying the price right now with the rest of the bad drops. I'll just... Uh, I'll get more slugs later if needed. Okay, anything else? Yep, that should be it. Um... It's not enough to fix it anyway. Although, I could get the lock... Mm, no, I shouldn't. I'll just fix my, my current gun. And we should be okay. Yeah. Uh, too bad I forgot. I should have checked what the AK needed. Maybe this guy had it, but... Uh, well, too late now. Okay, let's sell everything we don't need. Actually, considering selling the upgrade, I don't know if it's worth lugging, around, lugging it around. It is 3 kilos in the end. And uh, honestly, for... 3,000 rubles, you can just upgrade it at the mechanic. Actually... Sorry, mistype. Nah. I'll just uh, buy some ammo off of him. <clears throat> you have meds. Hmm... Nothing I need. I'm good on food, good on water. Okay, ammo it is. That should be good. And I'll put this right here just in case we need it. Okay. <clears throat> Let's check what missions we have. Hmm. Only turn-ins? Not, not even gonna bother with those right now. Let's just head down to Rookie Village. Get Hip's mission as well. She would be really useful as a companion. Um, even if she doesn't do much, I really need Meat Shield. Okay, switch to FMJ because usually there's there's some stalkers here. Oh, looks like we're good. Okay, if there's a bandit there, there's more. I'm not sure I want to deal with it right now. So let's just go around. See what's on the other side. There's another one there. Ooh, a freedom. Yeah, no. No, we're not fighting that right now. Yeah, 
even though we have a friend with us, uh, I'd rather not take any unnecessary risks. Because mutants, you can dodge them most of the time, but uh, you never know when you get one tapped in the head by a stalker. At least early game, so let's just go around and uh, off to Rookie Village. Swap back to the Hydroshock. Oh, I'm hearing flashes. Okay, let's let's keep moving. Oh, here we are. Oh, calm down. Okay, we'll take the ecologist quest. We'll probably not start doing it right away. We'll get some artifact hunting gear and then maybe... But it's still good to have it. As for Hip, yeah, we'll find you a Taz whenever we find you a Taz. And as always, gone a bit of a looting spree here. Okay, let's see, what missions do we have? Hmm, supplies from Meadow. That should be easy. What do we have in Meadow? Maybe a few bandits. And uh, in the eastern part, usually um, I've either fought poltergeists and once a Bureau, so this should be good. If it's a Bureau, we'll just uh, pull back so we don't get hit, hit by the force, force push <laughs> ability. Right, mercenary in the garbage, sure. I'll just take all the kill missions. Okay. Oh, and because our task board has such a huge range, I'm actually getting Missions from the military to the south. <laughs> but they're all uh, item request missions, so we'll probably not do any of them. I only have five bandit patches, so I won't do that mission for Sidorovich either. Let's just uh, see what else we can loot. Tell some stuff and... Uh, I will probably drop the big weapons here, just so they don't weigh us down, since I want to take a little trip to uh, the swamp and then move over to Agroprom. Okay, what do we not need? what I think I'm actually gonna keep everything I'll sell you the vodka hmm am I good on meds good enough I don't have any 
anti-radiation, but we can deal with that with vodka. I'll take just one rad resistance med. Okay, we'll drop the weapons here. Hmm. I'm... Uh... I'm going to keep the MP5 just in case. Okay, is there anything else I should drop? Nah, we'll keep these. Upgrade kit. There we go. Okay. So. Mutants and bandits. We can do that. Especially since we have our friend with us. Shouldn't be too hard. Actually, mutants first. And there it is. One dog. Got him. Okay, bandits next. we have two grenades so I might just sneak in see if I can drop a grenade on them Probably all around the campfire in that corner right there. So we'll just sneak in nice and easy. Got him. Oh, there's more. Oh. Kill him. What are you doing, boy? I think he'd die from a shot in the head.
Well, that's done. Oh, great. So in the end, I still have to go deal with freedom. I have 49 more bullets. Okay, let's see if we can do this again. Just nice and easy. How are you not dead yet? Oh, that did it. Yay. Okay, and where's the other one? There he is. Okay. That wasn't half bad. Could have been much better, but... Okay. Next up, we're going to Meadow. Yeah, we should be able to handle it. We still have some bullets, especially Hydra Shock, so if we make sure to avoid the bandits there, it should be alright. And we have our friend with us, who was actually useful for once. Everything seems to be clear. Except my stamina. I do hear some zombies over there. They always spawn there. Actually, that campfire is lit. Rather not fight every, every, anything over there. So let's just make a run for it. I'll even set my guy to ignore. Let's see. 
No stashes? No stashes. Oh, that's too bad. All right. We have some friendlies here. Let's see. Do they have any missions for us? Mercenary in Dark Valley. No, we're not going to Dark Valley. And Snork Hands. Uh, if I am going to get Snork Hands, I will keep them for hip. Just because it's so annoying to get them. She will need a total of eight Snork Hands for, for her mission. So until we're finished with that, I, I'd rather just keep any Snork Hands I come across. And until we get a better weapon, I would actually prefer not to fight Snorks at all. Don't see any bandits over there. Which is good. The last few times I was here, it was pretty clear. But you never know what you can expect. As I said, I, I've seen poltergeists, I've seen a bureau, and bloodsuckers around here. And I, except poltergeists, which are pretty easy to deal with, I would rather not fight anything. Here's our guy. Oh. Uh, well, it's a bolt carrier. I'm not going to take the whole weapon. It's a bit too heavy, and there's no way I can fix it yet. I'll need army rifle, which is advanced tools. So, this will have to do. Okay. But with this, I think we'll end it for today. And for the next episode, we'll just turn in our missions head to the swamp, do a few missions around here as well, and see if we can get some stashes and try and get our basic tools. I also just realized right now that I forgot to take the Strelok mission. <laughs> so after we come back to Rostock, we will actually have to do this whole thing all over again, but hopefully we'll do it with better weapons. But until then, have a great day and hope you enjoyed.